great year. I don't know how long I'll be. Yeah, as you wish. We expect something in return. This just won't do. <laughs> but then perhaps General Mueller should have given this project to Mengele or one of the other butchers instead of me. of our troops on the Russian front is crippling us. You said you could devise a drug that would give this dead soldier movement so he could be used as a shield for the living troops, yeah? If you lied about your abilities, then you are a traitor, Doctor. I didn't die, but I need more time. I don't have the authority to extend time. But I must report your failure. This world ain't big enough for the both of us, partner. I will conquer the world, and there is nothing you can do to stop me. I wouldn't say that, just sidewinder. <gasps> Ha <laughs> ha 
never know what they're going to do or say. Let me hide in your pocket. You have been stealing. Father, I didn't steal it. Peppermints, peppermints everywhere, look. It's a good job you put plenty of candy into Peter's pocket. Oh, he might have been very angry with you. Mightn't we, Peter? I would forgive him. All right, children. Now, the puppets are very tired. They must go to bed now. Sleep? Puppets need to sleep? Puppets need sleep just as much as you do. Goodbye. Please come back and see us again soon. Don't go here too long. Come, Peter. Come, children. devoted to them. They, they love your puppets. The children enjoy the show and I am rewarded by their laughter, which is honest. If not always prudent. I wonder if they'd laugh so hard if they truly understood what they were watching. Oh, I'm sure they would. Political satire is one of the marks of a healthy society. I didn't get your name. Lord and Eric Stein fellow puppeteer. I've been carving marionettes since I was 10 years old, and I must say your craftsmanship is superb. You are very kind, Lieutenant. How do you manipulate him without string works? Authorization. It is my own method. Fascinating. Almost like magic. One day I'd like to see you work. I'm sure that could be arranged. You are an artist here, Toulon. I just hope that you'll be allowed to continue practicing your art. <laughs> Eight shows a week is enough practice for me. <laughs> Quite. For your own sake, you might consider changing the subject matter of your shows. It is just a puppet show. The children like it as it is. Well, thank you very much. Good night, Frau Toulon, and good night to you, fellow puppeteer. Good night. Stein could be a real problem, my darling. Not if we don't show fear. Come on, my friends. <laughs> Time for dinner. <laughs> you gave quite a performance tonight. Always managed to be first in line for dinner, eh? Mm. You have such a big appetite. You could easily be the first in line if you wanted to, because you were bigger than anybody else. You're not a bully boy, are you? Always joking, as a friend of mine would say. For you, uh, life is just one big battle for you, isn't it? Bang, 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 and you are happy as a sandboy.
Well, sir, for years I have been trying to paint your portrait. Oh, I'm sure you didn't. No, no, no. Every time I tried, you finished up looking like my mother. Ooh. I'm hopeless with canvas and paint. Beautiful. She is the image of you. Oh, darling. What have I done to deserve you? You didn't do anything. Experienced men are very sexy. Sometimes I think my life began when I met you. And now I would die without you. I'm never going to leave you. Never. The show itself is a disgusting burlesque of the Führer and makes a mockery of the Reich. Yeah, have some men ready to leave immediately. Sir, there's something else. Yeah. Leutnant. What is this? I may be wrong, but it seems as though these wooden figures are walking about on their own. You're not mistaken, sir. <laughs> Explains this. I really can't, sir. Herr Toulon has developed a method of animating his puppets without string. He claimed they were motorized, but it's much more than that. I've seen them walk, react to sound as if they could hear. It's as if they were alive. Stein. Have you lost your senses? It, it, it's the truth, sir. In the pictures. Oh, gross. I must speak to Toulon before the Gestapo does. Impossible. Have the car brought around. I never take things at face value, but if Stein is even half right, this could be very important to my work. If Toulon has the information, I'll get it for you, Doctor. Oh, yeah, yeah. And you'll end up killing him and will learn nothing. You have an obligation to the Death Corps project, too. I have an obligation to expose the dissident and to silence him! If too long can be of use, I'll take that into consideration. Get me General Mueller. It's Dr. Hess. Yes, it's urgent. I'm sorry to bother you, General, but we have a matter brewing that might delay the progress of the Death Corps project. Indefinitely. We need to talk to a puppeteer named Andre Toulon who can assist us. No, I understand your need to speak to Toulon before Klaus clatters things up with his torture chambers. Put him on. It's General Mueller for you. Major, I want you to cooperate with Dr. Hess completely, and that's an order, and I don't want this kind of call again. I'm tired of separating you two like fighting schoolboys. You have already been out. My only request is that during the raid, you let my men do their job. Do not interfere. We wouldn't want to see your engine, Hess.
Just like the real thing, huh? <laughs> Only more intelligent. <laughs> This theater is closed as the authority of the German High Command. Your career as an entertainer is over here, Tolo. This is one of the puppets I was telling you about. I would like to talk to you later about your work. Ah. And here's the miracle. Yeah. That, that's what I saw, yes. Well, that shouldn't be difficult to analyze. What we need is the process. Here, too long. Would you work with me, my No! Take what you want, you bastards, and get out of here. That would be you, Puppeteer. Oh, oh my God, what have they done? Put him in the second car. Oh. Take him to Gestapo. I'm not leaving my wife. Elsa, my God. I'll call for an ambulance. Get him out of here. You will be all right, I promise you. This will be all right. Just leave me alone, don't you? You filthy, murdering swine. Now put the toys in with the toy maker. It's time to get back to work now. My God, Kraus, that wasn't necessary. But you need it. are correct, I know it will be of use. But a great deal depends on Toulon sharing his secret. I'm under orders as well, and the higher authority wants a demonstration of your results. Yesterday. Oh, I'll get with Toulon as soon as Major Kraus makes it possible. We should have waited to kill the woman. We need this man's cooperation. I'm stupid of you, Carlson. Worthy of you. 
Here, get her. I don't see the death of the Jew woman as a problem. Yes. They're both sitting in front of me now. I see. Thank you. You ought to be congratulated, Klaus. Herr Toulon has escaped your custody. I want a thorough search of the living quarters. Mit Ihrer Erlaubnis, hier ist niemand aufzufinden. Jawohl. Bernd. Jawohl, Herr Major. Search every building within a five block radius. Too long. You are a genius. 
genius. Hassan! Life's blood away. Else. Oh, God. No thing will stop me from seeking you out and making each one of you to your knees for what you have done. And you will cry me mercy, and I will have none. No mercy, my friends. No mercy.
Elsa, this is the best I can do for you now. But you can still revenge yourself. I'll be one hour. Takes the car to be serviced. Johnny turn here. And Eric. Expect to be out all night. Yavon? Have your car ready. Have yourself ready. Have your asshole ready. Good night, fellow puppeteer. This is excellent, Major. This is nothing. There, there is no progress here. Open your eyes, will you? It's true he remained animate for just a few minutes. There was no sign of violent rage this time. This subject could be controlled from the field. He was in a suicidal state, so he simply related back to his before-death behavior. But give me a soldier who was killed by the enemy in battle. And the results will be very different. Toulon's genius is at work. I need to speak to that man, Kraus. And so do I. <sighs> You're not my driver. There's Lieutenant Stein. Dead, sir. You see, you saw no one living here, nothing at all? No, sir. I found him and contacted headquarters. Have the body removed, send a report back to me. Mr. Brahe, look at the cancer house. 
Sajjan! This is exactly what we found at the marionette theater. This is too long, isn't it, Major? Yeah, too long. I want every inch of this city searched. Find him. I don't care how many patrols it takes. him! I think we will be safe here. Tomorrow we start all over again, killing murderers in the middle of a war. This is not enough, Doctor. We're almost there. If I can get to Toulon, I know we can prolong the soldier's new life. But I must get to him. Rice headquarters has informed us that there's not enough time to wait for Toulon's recapture. General, we are very close to finding him. Does this, this, this toy maker, Major, manage to kill one of your men? How is that possible? An investigation is underway. Lieutenant Stein was very careless. That seems to be a problem of yours. Doesn't it, Cross? No, I don't want any more excuses for humiliation to me. I'd rather have you two shot than be disgraced in Marshal Goering's eyes once again. Now, if you will excuse me, I have a top level meeting. Wilhelm Klutz, 47B.
Now be careful. Muller will be well armed. Of course, so are you. I wish I could handle going as well as I can handle you. on you very soon. did you find me? Mm. By accident, Herr Toulon. Mm. Mm. Uh, Peter and I have been hiding in this cellar for two days. The Gestapo or the SS? Gestapo. I need a place to keep Peter till I can get him to Switzerland. We didn't know you were here, Herr Toulon, I swear it. Mm. You won't give us away, will you? I would be a fool if I did. Now we're all fugitives together. Yeah, 
That's a slow assess, yeah? Look at the bloodstains, Kraus. The general was hit standing in the middle of the hallway, then he fell. And this is the first bullet fired. If the assassin fired and missed, why didn't Mueller shoot back, yeah? <laughs> I'm sure he did. So why is there no body? Mueller could not have missed at such a close range. I don't know. And sure can see. I've never seen a bullet this small. What is it, Hess? Oh, no. The Gestapo found out my wife was originally from Warsaw. So they came to our house and arrested her, claiming she was a spy. How did you escape? We didn't. I came home just as they were taking her away. I found Peter hiding in the kitchen cupboard. Oh. Ah, here comes supper. Good boy. It's a picnic. You like this, don't you, boy? Yes, it's been a lot of fun. But uh, I'll be glad to go home. My mother says she will be back soon and we'll all go to Switzerland together. Yeah, we all go. Together. 10,000 marks for information leading to Toulon's capture. I want to see posted all over the city within the hour. When you find Toulon, you're going to execute him, aren't you, Krauss? Did you know that Toulon taught medicine in Paris? Quite a background in surgery and chemistry. I wonder why he gave it up. Curious now. Answer me! Yes, he will be executed immediately, and it'll be my good pleasure to fire the first bullet that kills him. I won't allow it. Andre Toulon is an enemy of the Reich and of the New World Order. When the tin gods are destroyed, the new world will be rebuilt by geniuses like Andre Toulon. Something you and I will never live to see, Kraus. I know you won't, Doctor. But until I get that order, you will continue the work. God! Until Toulon is captured, I think it best you work under armed supervision. See that Dr. Hess is escorted home. Stay with him until you are relieved. Heil Hitler. should be in bed. I'd like to stay up late. The way they move, it's magic, isn't it? Yes, yes. <laughs> and they can live forever. What happened to his arm? Oh, he got hurt doing me a favor. And I can't get the parts I need to make him a new arm. However, he has five more. Oh, I could get it. Yes, I could go to your workshop and get everything you need. I'd be your assistant. No, Peter, you stay here until your father says it's safe for you to leave. You can be my assistant and you look after my other puppets for me. All right. You know, someone looks a lot like the man that came to see my mother the day she went away.
sorry, Peter. Now you go to bed, and tomorrow I'll put on a special puppet shoot for you. The six shooter? The six shooter. Good night. Good night. Yes, I did, Peter. I want you to stay inside, out of sight. Yeah, too long kept me safe. And tomorrow, I get to be his assistant as a puppet show. I want you to stay away from here too long. It's for your own good. Now go to sleep. You wouldn't volunteer for a medical experiment, would you? No, no. I didn't think you would. Then, I must go out. Oh, come on. Follow me. We don't want you getting into trouble with Major Kraus. Lord must have kept the record. You could at least help me, Private. <laughs> Danke. If you really want to help here too long, Peter, you'll tell me where he is. All I want to do is talk to him. And if I see anything that's not right, I will leave right away. I am his assistant, you know. Yeah, I know. You are a man of authority. But I don't want to harm here too long. Because I don't want you mad at me. Well... I can't tell you exactly. That's an order.
too long. I brought a friend. Don't be afraid. I'm Dr. Hess here too long. I remember you. I didn't come to have you arrested. He, he promised me he only wanted to talk. Peter, take these doors away and clean them like a good assistant. Sit. Killing you would be no problem for me, Doctor. I know. I just wanted to speak with you. Be careful what you say. My friends are very sensitive. Mm -hmm. I thought we could talk, doctor to doctor. You have the wrong man. You taught medicine in Paris. Chemistry and anatomy were specialties. The Gestapo does its homework. I'm impressed. Oh, to hell with the Gestapo. I came here on my own. I've come to learn of your genius firsthand. Your promise was incredible. Why did you stop teaching? After the war, I couldn't stand the sight of blood. So my skill in anatomy took a different direction. They're amazing. What is the secret, please? It was given to me during a trip I took to Egypt with Elsa 15 years ago. It is ancient and very simple. It is in the archives of every museum on the continent it will be found. Not so. I have been working on a drug for over a year to reinstill animation, and all I have is random movement at best, and even then only for a few minutes. But I look at your wooden creations, and they are alive as you and I. You had my serum. Yeah, completely organic. But I have used it, but cannot duplicate what you've done. You didn't know your subjects, Doctor. When I call these puppets my friend, it is no mere affectation. I knew them in life. Hans Seidemann, the bookkeeper. Very funny, full of tricks and practical jokes. Shot by the Nazis. Hermann Strauss, a truck driver, executed for smuggling food to the Jewish ghetto. And Elsa. You were there when they took her from me. Yes. But what gives them life? The will to live. I knew each of them before they were cut down by the Nazis. And they all wanted the same thing. The chance to go on fighting. That was the difference. They wanted this life after death. They volunteered. Yes. The secret of the new life cannot be duplicated in the laboratory. It is the human spirit. An excellent likeness. The reward is 10,000 marks. I don't want your money. If I show you where Toulon is hiding, all I want is freedom for my wife and my son so that we can leave Berlin and never return. Mm. First show me where he is. <laughs> yeah, as good as new. Are you going to send one of your puppets to visit me, Toulon? Not just now. At some other time, we could have worked together and done great things. Doctor Hess went in almost an hour ago. He ordered me to stand guard. When you see Hess, shoot him. That's an order. Let me get my son. Mark Schnell. <laughs> <laughs> 
Get away from my son. Peter is safe hands. This is Dr. Hess. A friend. I don't care who he is. Stand away from my son. Now, Peter, come to me. But father. Peter! Go with your father, Peter. Who saw you come in here? No one. It's the only way we can be a family. Yeah. What about two men? You don't understand. We do what we must for Mama. What did you say to him? Nothing, Major. I say nothing. He was wrong, yeah? No. He was wrong, yeah? I say nothing. <laughs> oh, he's 
done with. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Oh! Oh! Keep fighting. Men like you need to survive. Look, my friends, I got us home. We'll help you, Puppet Master. into a mirror, is it not? 
Now you can see what a small man you really are, Major Klaus. Is this what your puppets are for? <laughs> for your temper tantrums? <laughs> you think I'm afraid of this? <laughs> you will be afraid. Traveling alone, Major Kraus? No. You should be boarding in a few minutes. Look, Mother, dolls. Not dolls, puppets. I never heard of a boy playing with dolls before. <laughs> Where are you and your son traveling? Switzerland. And then maybe to America. Have you enjoyed Berlin? No, I have not. I had a very unpleasant experience. I am recuperating. I hope you're well now. Well, some people lost their heads, but friends saw me through. All aboard, the express to Geneva is leaving from track number seven. Einsteigen bitte. Der Schnellzug nach Gym. Wer ab und Bahnsteiger Nummer sieben.
Mm-hmm. <laughs>